guys, this is Make Power 100 and today I'm here to show you guys how to do this crazy smoky eyes. Yay! So stay tuned for the whole tutorial guys and I'll show we'll you guys later. Bye bye. Take care and 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 wait. Have a good semester. I I start college so my new semester is about to start in two days. So, I don't know about you guys, but if you're in school, good luck with your midterms coming up, isn't it, isn't it, isn't it, isn't it? But, um, if you're not, then, oops, your school semester started, and if you work full time, well, congratulations, you're working very hard, and you pass through the Christmas break, so the workload is over, and I hope you're more relaxed now, and enjoy my makeup, yes! Bye bye. Okay, we are here to do some. So first of all, we're gonna start applying our eye primers for the base of our eyeshadows. There is nothing special about this eyes, but the more you blend it, the better it gets. Sorry, I have my mirror up here, so I'm not gonna look at it up here while well, I do this. So for that. I'm going to use my Morpheus palette and I'm going to take this nice brown. You see it? Right there. I'm going to take this and I'm going to apply that just to warm up my, uh, my. And you can take any blending brush. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go here. What it's going to do is going to soften that smoky eye I'm going to create with the black. You can do any um, brown color, any matte color. This one has a little bit of shimmer in it. Because this is a um, shimmer palette. I'm going to do the same thing to the other eye. Okay. You guys see, I'm not, ca I'm not caring about where it's going right now. I'm just going to focus this. To blend it actually a little bow is to bring this one and this one a little higher right there. So you're gonna look like something like that, okay? So we smoke that out, soften it out, that's nice looking. After that you're gonna take your um black eyeshadow. And for this I'm gonna use this black. Because I don't have any other black. And for that, you're going to take any brush that is um, nice bristle. You're going to pick up and you're going to pack. You're not going to blend, you're going to pack. So. You got a nice amount. And we're going to leave the inner corner just for the lighter color a little, okay? And we're gonna come back to that. Wow, somebody just punched me into the eye. Don't worry, we're gonna blend it. <laughs> we're gonna do the same, and we're gonna apply it to the other eye. So that is how pretty much we're gonna look like for today. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so we have a nice amount in the both eyes. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take a really nice big brush and I'm gonna blend everything together. So I'm gonna do this from here to upward. It's gonna give us a really nice eyeshadow effect. So. See how it's coming out? Really nice, blended. We're gonna do the same thing on this side. Open your eyes nice and big, so you can see the transition from like darkish brown to the black. 
after that, we're gonna make our eyes look a little wider. And I'm gonna take um, this nude eye pencil. You can take any nude eye pencil. It's gonna make our eyes look a little brighter, more awake. So we're gonna apply that. I'm gonna take it down all the way. See? You can already see a difference between this and this eye. So I'm gonna do the same thing in this. See, my eyes are a little more open now. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take a small angle brush. Really, really, it's not even a small angle brush, it's a smudging brush actually. So. What I'm gonna take, I'm gonna apply the dark um, black color right here and I'm gonna blend it out with the halfway through with my eyes with the brown. Okay, so just in the corner, just a little bit, then some brown, then I'm just gonna blend it. Okay, so I'm gonna take some black. So after that, we're gonna take some brown. You can take the same color, you can take a different color. And I'm gonna go over on the leg and I'm gonna drag it down a little more. So that's gonna soften that black. And it's gonna give us a really cool effect too. Some people are afraid to use black, you can use a brown color. With that brown I'm gonna do is gonna create the shadowy effect. Okay, so now we look like somebody punched us in the eye. Right? Right? Okay, so um, if you have any q tip or you wanna remove some of the makeup out that you have or some foul out that you have I'll suggest take your um, powder and take a foundation brush dip into a powder brush and go here just to clean out your look see just gonna hide any foul out anything we had can apply a tape at the end so it doesn't fall out that much I will say. Right? You can take your um eyeliner. Any eyeliner will work just fine for this. But I'm gonna use my um benefit eyeliner. It's great what I'm gonna do I'm gonna twist it around, get some product out. I'm gonna apply this eyeliner on, okay? So we're gonna look up, chin up, like this. stop seeing what's going on. <laughs> My eyes stopped.
loosening a little bit. So I have really nice wings on the bow tie. I love my dramatic wings, I'm sorry. If you don't, you can just have a little wing and blend that in. Just dropped everything. I hope you guys like it and I shall talk to you guys later. Bye bye!